welcome back to another video and welcome to part two of my Sephora VIB damage basically so the first part is already up on my channel if you guys are interested I will actually link it down below so you guys can check that video out in that video I basically hauled all of the cosmetics products that I got today we're gonna be hauling all of the skincare that I got so as much as I love makeup I love skin you guys I feel like you can't get the best out of your products without good skin so I'm really excited to show you guys all the skincare products that I got you guys this box is heavy so let's get into it before we jump into the video please don't forget to give this video a huge thumbs up please don't forget to subscribe to my youtube channel if you have not already and without further ado let's get into this haul let me just show you guys all the new goodies and skincare that i decided to pick up so girl sit tight and let's get into it Okay, guys so the first thing that I picked up are the Shiseido facial cottons and I actually have already used these I love these I cannot live without these cottons I use these every single day morning and night to apply my toner it is just so so good this is what they look like right here if it'll focus they are just so bomb you guys and I really love them honestly so I did decide to pick up another one of these I actually had a brand new pack that I just opened today so I'm so excited that I got a backup and the next thing that I picked up is this. This is actually really intriguing. This is the Sephora Favorites. Um, Sephora does these very often where they'll put like a ton of different brands into like one kit and sell it like a Sephora Favorites. So this is the Give Me Some Balm. You guys know my lips are dry, honey. So I'm always here to try a new lip balm. So this is an entire kit. And this kit was actually $29. And you get quite a few things. So you get the Jouer um, Essential Lip Enhancer. You get the Peach Lip Balm from Too Faced. You get one from Tarte. Even one from Fresh and honestly this was a great deal $29 and you get to try all these lip balms I thought it was a steal the next thing that I got is actually a newer product this is the wishful skin thirst trap coconut mask and this is what it looks like right here I love the packaging on here very nice and holographic and honestly I really really wanted to try the um, neck mask that she launched but it was already sold out um, so I just got my hands on this which I'm excited to try you guys know I love her um, enzyme exfoliator it's bomb um, the next thing that I picked up is actually something that's really, really old. This is like an OG product, you guys, but I personally never tried it. Most of you know I used to work at Sephora and people used to come in for this left and right and actually never got the chance to try it. I just never bought it. So I decided to pick it up. This is the Bobbi Brown Vitamin Enriched Face Base. This is actually an all-in-one primer and moisturizer. This is what it looks like right here. And I feel like this is one of those products, you guys, that are just like a cult favorite, like you honestly don't even need to sell this because it sells itself. So this is what it looks like right here. A super, super luxe jar. And I'm really excited to try it, especially because right now my skin is so dry, you guys. So I needed something that's a little bit thicker. So if I can get a moisturizer and a primer in one, I'm here for it. The next thing that I picked up is actually a backup. This is the Ula Hendrickson Truth Juice Daily Cleanser. This is a cleanser that also removes makeup. I actually put this in my recommendations video. You guys, honestly, I'm so happy that I ordered this because I literally just finished the one that's in my bathroom and I cannot live without it. It's so, so good. I've actually been using it morning and night and my skin has been doing so good lately, you guys. No breakouts or anything. So I really feel like this has something to do with it. I love this. Um, and it smells really nice. It smells very citrusy. So in the morning, it is so refreshing. The next thing that I picked up is the Fresh Vitamin Nectar Antioxidant Glow Water. This is actually a facial mist. Um, and I actually specifically got this one because number one, Fresh is just an amazing brand. I also got a couple things from them as well. And number two, I see Nicole Concilio rave about this. And honestly, I always like to use a facial mist before I put on my serum, but after my toner. If you guys didn't know, you, you can actually use less serum if you're putting a facial spray on your face before you apply your serum because your face is nice and damp. So you're actually going to be able to like maneuver and really spread out the products better. So I decided to pick this one up. I also like the fact that it's an aerosol can, which I love and this is what it looks like right here on the website it looks pretty small so for the price I was like do I get it do I not but I decided to get it and it's actually a pretty big bottle you guys um so this is bomb I can't wait to try it honestly this is an 8.4 fluid ounce 
bottle. So I'm excited for this. I'll keep you guys updated. By the way, I am going to be doing actually an updated night routine soon. So be on the lookout for that because I want to show you guys what I do for my skin at night. Before bed, that's when I do most of my skincare. So moving on. The next thing that I got is the Milk Makeup Vegan Cleanser. This is their Milk Vegan Cleanser. This is what it looks like right here. Obviously, you guys, I'm not going to be trying all this stuff at once. But like I said, it was a Sephora VIB sale. Like, how often am I going to be able to get this stuff on a discounted price? never so i decided to pick up everything that i've been wanting to try this is what it looks like right here you guys this packaging is so nice like i love this it's gonna look so cute and fun. okay so besides the cleanser i actually also decided to pick up the milk makeup vegan milk moisturizer this is what it looks like right here i heard that this is insanely good for dry skin so this right here says it's a luxe daily moisturizer with a rich blend of vegan milks to instantly quench skin um, micro droplet technology allows skin to easily absorb the milky, non-greasy formula, which I love. I hate, like, greasy, oily-feeling moisturizers. Mm -mm. I like to feel the moisturizer on my skin, but not an oily residue, like, no. And also this packaging, you guys, this packaging is sick. I love it. It is so, so good. Like, I could definitely see that, like, as a primer, but, like, in skincare, usually a skincare is, like, more clean, like looks nice the bottle's very luxe but this is like i really like this the next thing i actually picked up is actually an spf like you guys know i don't have any spf in my collection at the moment or none in my routine that i currently use and girl spf is so important so i did pick one up this is the super goop glow screen broad spectrum sunscreen this is spf 40 this is what it looks like right here and honestly this one got me with the glow if that makes sense so it's gonna be a sunscreen but it has like a nice luminosity to it so i'm actually really excited to try this because i feel like it's gonna give me such a beautiful glow under my foundation and then even when i'm not wearing foundation i feel like it's gonna give me like a really nice radiance like a healthy look to the skin so i'm really excited for that the next thing that I actually picked up is the Summer Fridays Jet Lag Mask. This was actually a recommendation from one of you guys. And unfortunately, by the time I went on the website to order this, the full size was gone. Like, girl, gone. So they did have the travel size. Um, so I did decide to pick up the travel size. And honestly, if I like it, then I'll go in and buy the full size. It's not a big deal. Because um, this tube is really tiny, like... How many uses am I really going to get out of this? I have no idea. But hopefully I could get at least three or four to see if I really like it. But honestly, people love this. So I'm really excited to try it. The next thing that I got is also from Summer Friday. This is the Lip Butter Balm. This is actually a newer product that also launched during the Sephora VIB sale. So I did want to pick it up because as you guys know, lip balms, like I said, are just my thing. I'm always, always down to try a new lip balm, a lip mask. And I really love this packaging. Super cute. It definitely reminds me of the Bite Beauty Agave Lip Mask, which is a really good one. So I'm excited to try this. I also got a few other lip products. I also picked up the Tatcha The Kiss You. I hope I said that right. Lip Mask. This is what it looks like right here. And you guys, this packaging is so luxe. This is also another thing that I launched. So here's what the lip balm looks like right here. It actually looks very promising. It also comes with like a little spatula, which is super cute because then you don't have to like stick your finger in the actual container, which, girl, I'm probably going to lose this little thing in like a day, to be honest. So I picked that up. I also picked up the Fresh Lip Treatment. This is the Sugar Advanced Therapy Lip Treatment. This is what it looks like right here. And honestly, I picked up this one. That way I can actually just throw it in my bag or my work bag and just take it on the go. That way, you know, if my lips are feeling dry and crusty, which they are 100% of the time, I can just go ahead and pop this on my lips. And this is what it looks like right here. So it's just like a typical uh, lip balm, no color, it's just translucent. So I'm really excited to try this as well. And then the last lip product that I got was also a new launch on Sephora. I had to try it, like it's a lip balm, I have to. This is the Rose Petal Soft Lip Cream from Fresh. I'm really excited to try this as well. A lot of beauty gurus have been getting this in PR and they've been saying that it's really, really bomb. So I'm really excited to try it and see if it's really worth all the hype. And like I said, I heard Fresh products are really, really good. I tried their Soy Face Cleanser. Um, and I loved it. I just never repurchased it. And with that lip balm, they also launched the Fresh Rose Deep Hydration Face Cream, which I decided to pick up as well. This is what it looks like right here. So I know you guys, I got a lot of like skincare, which obviously I'm not gonna be able to use all this at one time, but girl, as long as I don't open it, we're good. 
So this is what it looks like right here. Um, very luxe glass bottle. It's actually very heavy. Very heavy. It's actually very heavy and has a lot of weight to it. So I'm really excited to try that one out as well. And then the last thing that they launched, which I am so excited about, you guys. This is the Fresh Rose Deep Hydration Oil Infused Serum. It says it's a balance of hydration and nourishment. What? Like, I want 10 of them. I was so excited when I saw this. I cannot wait to try this. Um, let me just show you guys what the bottle looks like, which the bottle looks so luxe. I'm definitely going to put this on my vanity while I'm using it. Look at this, you guys. It's so pretty. It's, like, so luxe. You can see, like, the little... I feel like that's oil in there. You know how, like, an eye makeup remover, you can see the oil as you, like, go like this to it? Same thing with this. So I'm really excited for this. Um... It says it's a lightweight treatment um, that strikes the perfect balance between water and oil to deliver deep hydration and nourishment for skin that instantly looks dewy, soft, and plumped with moisture. So I'm really excited to use this. I actually keep you guys updated um, and let you know how I like it. I do have still my current skincare that I'm using that I definitely want to finish before I jump into any of this new stuff. So give me some time, but I will definitely let you guys know how that works. The next thing that I got was also a new launch, which you guys know I love Glow Recipe. I love their watermelon glow mist. It is just one of my favorites, and I recommend it to everyone. But... They did come out with the Glow Recipe Watermelon PHA plus BHA Pore Tightening Toner. Like, girl, tightening toner? Yes, because we want to look young forever. So this is what it looks like right here. This thing is humongous, you guys, honestly. Um, it'd be nice if I opened it. I'll be right back. Let me just open the box. Okay, guys, so this is what the packaging looks like right here. I love the bottle. I think it is so, so cute. I love the how you can see like the liquid inside and it's a nice like light pink liquid. Um, I've been seeing people use this and it looks like it kind of has like a sticky dewy texture. I'm not sure because like I said I haven't used it and I don't want to open it until I'm like ready to use it. Um, but I'm really excited for this and I cannot wait to try it because like I said Glow Recipe has my heart forever because girl that watermelon glow mist is just amazing. So Let's see, what else do we have? We're actually almost done. We don't have too much left. So the next thing that I got is actually something that I've already tried. This is the Sephora um, Hyaluronic Acid All Day Hydrator. Um, so this is a moisturizer basically from the Sephora brand. And this is what it looks like right here. I've already tried this before. I've also tried the cleanser. Um, you guys, this is bomb, honestly. For the price, you cannot beat it. It is so, so affordable. And this under makeup is amazing. That's the only way that I use this right under my makeup, like to prep my skin. It's just so, so good. I love the consistency. It's more of like a runny consistency. So it soaks into the skin right away. And I just needed another one because I finished my last one and I never replaced it. So I did pick up this. Next thing that I decided to pick up is actually also from Glow Recipe. And I feel like this is something that they're known for besides their watermelon glow mist. This is the Glow Recipe Pineapple Sea Bright Serum. It says it brightens and smooths the skin. This is what it looks like right here, and I'm really excited to try this. I love the packaging. The only thing is I heard that this does not have the most pleasant smell to it. Okay, so yeah, like I said, I heard this doesn't have the best scent, um, but we shall see. This is what it looks like right here. Um, the bottle is super, super cute. Like, let me show you guys up close. It's like a little pineapple. How cute is that? Love that. So I did pick up that as well. Um, I'm excited to try it. And then the next thing that I got is actually a brand that I've never heard of before. One of you guys actually recommended it to me. So I'm really excited to try it. This is the Youth to the People um, Super Berry Hydrate and Glow Oil. It's a facial oil. This is what it looks like right here. And I heard that it was bomb. So I'm really excited to try it. You guys know I am a dry skin girl. So I love all the hydration. This is what it looks like right here. I'm actually really excited to try it. It, to be honest it says apply two to five drops into hand and then press into skin so we will see it okay so the next thing that I got is actually also something that I have been wanting for such a long time you guys every time I go into Sephora I go over there and I look at it and I open it and I test it and then I'm like mm, that's too much money I don't need it but girl I need it. So I got the Tatcha the Dewy Skin Cream. This is the ultra hydrating and anti-aging replenishing Japanese purple rice. And this little girl. This is a pretty, pretty penny. But I'm so happy that it's finally in my collection. I wanted it for so, so long, you guys. And I just want to show you guys what it looks like. So here's what it looks like right here. 
super super luxe and it comes with like a little spatula on the top so you don't even have to dip your finger in there which i probably won't ever use to be honest so i'm really excited to try this um i'm pretty sure you guys have seen tatcha dewy skin cream everywhere so i finally have it in my collection and i'm gonna put it away until i'm ready to use it so i did pick that up the next thing i picked up is actually a hair product this is the briogeo don't Respair repair strengthening treatment oil you guys know i love me some briogeo they have such good hair products and i'm really excited to try this this is like such a luxe product you guys it has like a little flower just floating in there it is so beautiful like i cannot so this actually says that it's going to replenish your hair so the treatment oil fortifies hair with bioidentical lipids such as ceramides and essential fatty acids to help restore and replenish for smooth silky finish this lightweight oil is densely packed with hair essential ingredients and clinically proven repair technology that works to reinforce hair cuticles and protects against future damage so tell me more like I love that so I'm really excited to use this as well and it says that it's specifically for severely dry damaged hair which is me severely so I'm excited to try this and that's pretty much it we are almost almost done you guys the next couple of things I'm really excited for I know I've been saying I've been excited for like all this stuff you guys but this next brand I only picked up three things from them because girl they are expensive but I have been trying I've been wanting to try them for years you guys probably since um, I started working at Sephora I was like wow like people love that stuff like they swear by it so I was like I really want to try it but like girl the price point is just insane so like I'm kind of scared to love this stuff and then I have to go and spend the money every couple months to replenish my skincare but whatever so the brand that I'm actually talking about is Drunk Elephant if you guys have heard of them before then you know they have a cult following like Drunk Elephant is one of those brands that they have their customer that is loyal and just comes in, grabs what they need, buys it, and is out the door. Like, there's no looking, there's no shopping, they're like, okay, I need this, this, and this. I know my brand, and I'm out of here. So, I'm excited to try these things. The first thing that I got is the Drunk Elephant B Hydra Intensive Hydration Serum. This is what the serum looks like right here, and this packaging is so nice, you guys. So this says, like a cool drink of water for your thirsty skin, this ultra hydrating serum replenishes the complexion and improves the look of skin texture and tone. So, girl, I am so excited. And look at the inside of the box. It has like its own like pattern, super cute. And this stuff is actually a decent size. So this is what it looks like right here. I'm really, really excited to try this, you guys. I have no idea. You kind of like twist the cap and then it comes up and you have a pump. So I'm really excited for this. Like, I'm really, really excited. I think this is going to be the first couple things that I actually use out of everything that I got. So the next thing that I decided to pick up is the Drunk Elephant C Firma Day Serum. And girl, honestly, I got this because I saw Juicy Jazz using it in one of her, like, um, one-hour glam transformation videos. And she used this, and I was like... I'm going to try that. So this says it's a revolutionary vitamin C serum packed with ferulic acid to reveal a brighter firmer and more even looking complexion so love that we all love that bright skin right so i'm really excited to try this and i love the packaging it's like a neon orange like the camera's not even picking it up that's how bright it is and of course just like the other one you just kind of twist the cap and then the pump comes out from the top so i'm really excited for that and then the last thing that i got in this haul and the last thing from drunk elephant is the lala retro whipped cream so this says this multi-faced rescue cream infused with six rare african oils and plant ceramide complex provides replenishing barrier support to reinforce skin's acid mantle and defending against the effects of everyday stressors. So, girl, just give me some new skin, that's it. So here's what it looks like right here. It is massive, you guys. Like, there's a lot of products in here. And I love the fact that it's so hygienic. Like, honestly, it has this little thing up here. You kind of just press this part down right here, and then it comes out from this little hole. That way you know exactly how much you use, like, exactly how much is going to come out. This gives you the perfect amount so you're not wasting your product and putting on too much cream. So, honestly, I love that, especially because this is so damn expensive. Um, but, yeah. 
I'm really excited. So that is all the skincare that I purchased during the VIB sale, girl. Like, honestly, I have skincare for the next year or so because, honestly, it takes a few months for this stuff to start working and for you to see a difference and to really give it a chance. So I will keep you guys updated as I use everything. Of course, like I said, I can't use everything in one shot because just in case something gives me an allergy, I won't know what's giving me the allergy if I'm using all new things. So here and there, I'll insert one or two products into my skincare routine and see how they work out. So be on the lookout for favorite videos or even update skincare routine videos. And yeah, I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. That was everything. We finally completed all the damage that I did during the VIB sale. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed it. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!